Hello everybody, I am Biggie, I am back, and let's play Unlimited Saga. Here we are getting introduced to Anzan, who is a patron. And patrons in this game are like huge rock-like species of people. Which <laughs> is interestingly enough just like look like a, looks like a big round rock. And, but that's not the best thing about Anzan, actually. The, the best thing about him is the fact that he has the highest LP in the game and he has the best HP recovery available. Um, his starting panels just plain suck. So you might want to, um, if you're going to invest in um, having him in your team, you need to first up build up his um, Earth Elemental so that he becomes useful. And secondly, give him some very nice armor, so, so he becomes um, an, uh, an asset later in game. Okay, and check this out. He has a ton of earth arts learned, and that includes boulder, which basically is um, the only spell you really need from earth. Build up is good as well if you want to... Um, well, it's a good support spell. It really does buff up damage by, by a lot. But first of all, we're just gonna shove him and push him all the way to the front. Put Flatty Fly on here. And hopefully by the end of this quest, we should have um, Judy's Magic Tablet mastered. Not mastered, well, Cecile the Abyss Bell mastered. Okay, and if you check out the equipment, um, besides the rock mail, I think I will give him a sword. There we go. And an axe just in case. Um, what else? And that's it, I guess. And over here in this adventure, we have a lot of murals. And what happens is when you examine a mural, you trigger a battle. And these battles are generally um, encouraged. I would encourage you to do these battles because um, mural battles will net you some items, and one of those items is a magic tablet. So let's just wait until the screen loads. Sorry, That's guys, I have an old voice. Put your mind at ease, nope, nothing's wrong with your sound. That's how patrons um, talk. That's what they sound like. Uh, it's just a big bunch of vents popping out. It's just it's it's just a weird character design. I mean, it's just the big ball. Anyways, keep going. Some fire arrows. And have Judy cast Boulder as per usual. Now that we have six characters, though, things get a little complicated. We need to cycle characters around so that each of them get a chance at the big monster at, at, at the fight so for example for this battle I'm going to have Ongri sit out and for the next one I'll probably have Anzan sit out uh, considering he's taking a lot of damage and then Francis and Platy sits out uh, Judy doesn't well Judy cannot sit out because she has to um, learn from her tablet and yes you do probably notice that these two have already got um, axes black axes from Damascus the reason why I've given it up from Laura uh, you see last adventure I uh, replaced Laura's axe panel with uh, melee panels for the line of combo so that she has more strength so in the end um, her reels for the axes doesn't actually show up many panels anymore. Um, it's true that she will be able to deal as much damage now that she's got a sword instead of an axe. But I'm trying. I'm going for a different build. I, I want to show you. Um, oh, a couple of battles here. I want to show you um, how to build Laura as a warrior mage. You know, it's kind of an alternate build. Here we see more fortune telling. And ultimately I want to do that because um, I want Laura to be slightly more versatile. Yeah. Uh, 
Um, this among the elemental quests uh, will be the longest one, simply because um, you have a—it's just simply a long quest. Uh, the boss isn't too hard, um, but you'll end up. Well, this will probably end up being on uh, a couple of more videos than I uh, intended. Uh, go, come on. Uh, and this is what happens when you bomb at the um, fortune telling. Um, you get items. Usually you get a bit of serpentine because generally... Um, well, serpentine is not bad. It's just that um, they don't cost very much and um, they're only good as a blacksmithy ingredient so you can have a couple of them in stock um, just so that at the end of adventures you could um, increase the durability of um, your items uh, what else okay just a bit more fortune telling fortune telling is great with um, Cash because um, you just got to remember to be a little bit conservative about it because if uh, you end up with doing fortune telling and you bomb then you lose everything you get like something minuscule like eight gold okay more murals yes. and since we're now in a cave Laura will actually have to use her other familiar, which is um, her water one. I can't remember the name. I think it's Aegean or something like that. Okay. You sh uh, sometimes when you defeat uh, murals, you leave um, they leave a bit of a crevice, and you can walk through them. Over here, it's not a, it's, it's nothing special here. It's just a um, not even a treasure here. It's just a little preview of um, where we would eventually end up. And just jump over here. And I'm notice that I'm using um, Platy's wood familiar rather than um, Laura's water familiar because um, Laura's not a very good um, mage uh, water wise. So just have her check this out. More fortune telling. Yeah. Oh, it's a long ball. So that should be useful for. Yep, it's made from cedar. So it should be useful for um, Smithy. Okay, um, examine this mural. Oh, wait. Um, might be better to. There we go. Search around this area first. Treasure, so it's a hero. Giant fish. Okay, so we're heading off. And, oh, I head down here first, I guess. Oh, examine. Examine. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Um, there's a trap. I'll use the diffuse skill. Eventually, I want Ongri to have locksmith as well. So it's, um, I'm not sure if I've said that before or not. If only has locksmith and perhaps sharp eye, then um, he could fulfill a very good role, which is a basic thief role. Okay, I just check this treasure chest. Fortune teller. And remember, guys, if it's a main quest, you don't have any turn limit. Just take your time, explore. Um, every space. It's better to be thorough than miss a uh, piece of treasure. And as per usual, monsters don't spawn um, unless you move on to a different map. Oh, there's another treasure. And another mural. Okay, I just diffuse here. Okay, 
do a little bit better. Yep, best deal items are usually just uh, better choices. I'll just uh, grab it. Yep, I'll just attack this thing. 